This video is going to cover adding a category, adding a product, editing the homepage, adding a coupon, and order management. In this video, I'm going to cover how to add a new category to ASP.NET Storefront. So you go to the back end of the website and find the organization drop down and click on manage categories. And you may have some set up already and you, you might not. Um, but in any case, the way to add a brand new category to the top level is to scroll down and hit the add category link on the left hand side. And all you got to do is specify a category name. Call it new category. And that's it. Let's see if it shows up on the front end of the website. So I'll refresh the page and scroll down and sure enough there's our new category. You can see it's empty so we've got to add some products to it. We'll do that next. In this video I'm going to cover how to quickly add a product to ASP.NET storefront. So you'll want to go to the back end and under organization find manage categories and then you're just going to choose which category you want to put your product in and expand that category and then you'll want to expand the products node under that category and hit add product and then from there you can just add a product name choose the generic product type and select a manufacturer and then choose the simple product XML package for now. And the only other required field is going to be the price. So I'll add that and add my product. Now let's go find the product on the front end of the site. We put it under shirts and there it is. You can see it still needs a picture to get added to it, but it's there. And if I click through to the product page, it's up for sale. So that's it. In this video I'm going to cover how to update the content on your home page. So you'll want to go to the back end and underneath content you'll find manage topics and on the left hand side you'll see all the topics in your site. Uh, the one that controls the home page content is called home top intro. So I'll click on that topic and it'll open it up in the right hand side of the screen for editing and then from here you can see you've got a, a basic HTML editor and you can flip that between design and HTML view. So I'm gonna go ahead and just delete all of the HTML on the home page content area and you can see it empties it out in design view and just add some simple text to the home page And I'm going to go ahead and make that a header. So I can select that text and I'll choose heading one. And then you can scroll down and update the topic. So let's take a look at the front end of the site. Uh, back on the front end, if you hit refresh, you'll see the home page content is now gone and there's my new text. So that's all there is to it. In this video, I'm going to cover adding a coupon to ASP.NET Storefront. So to add a coupon from the back end, go to Configuration, Pricing and Promotions, and then Coupons. And then you'll want to hit Add New. And this is where you type in your coupon code. So I'll enter a coupon code. And then you can choose the type, whether it applies to the subtotal, for the product, I'm going to choose subtotal, and I'm just going to give myself a 50% discount and add the coupon. And then I'm going to copy that coupon code and go try it out on the front end of the website. So I'm going to add a product to the cart and then enter my new coupon code in the coupon code box and hit update. And then here you can see 
uh, I've got my 50% off applied to my subtotal and I can continue checkout. So that's how you set up a coupon in ASP.NET Storefront. To manage orders in ASP.NET Storefront, hover over orders from the top menu and select view manage orders and that'll take you to the order management screen. The top part of the screen allows you to adjust which orders are going to show so you can specify a start date and end date or you can use one of these quick queries here down below. So if I want to just select the orders from today, I can choose today and hit submit and if you scroll down you'll see that there's one order that matches for today and over here on the right are the details for that order. 